All right, guys, still Blues Moose Radio here, and that's called Blues Moose TV now, and we are here now backstage with Joan Primer, who is going on stage in uh, half an hour, and is really relaxing. Is this your regular uh, exercise for on stage, doing nothing? Yeah, right. doing nothing, just sitting there relaxing, thinking, thinking about it. Uh, you're now over for a small tour in, uh, in Holland. Yeah. What do you expect of the audience for uh, recording to your music? Well, I'm kind of used to coming here, and uh, uh, people seem to enjoy it every time I come here. It's not my first time. I'm always coming over here. Rob, King B Music, they always bring me over. And the people love the music, man. And, uh, I expect a good turnout crowd for, for each concert, yeah. It's a difference, it's a difference in, the, in, the, in the blues crowd that you, in, in Europe or America at this moment. Nah, there's no difference. It's just people that get out more. Here and they do in America, um, it's more common, but they just love it just as much as everywhere. You know, I, I I've been to many places and I see people love the blues the same all over the world. It's no different. <laughs> Could describe the blues for me in uh, one sentence. What would that be? <laughs> Some good old crazy music makes you go crazy. Blues, blues is just a feeling, man. Um, it's hard to describe it what it is, but uh, it to me is just uh, something that's coming from your heart, your mind, and you know, and you're thinking about what you're doing, something happened to you, uh, something happened to you, good or bad, you you can't describe it. It's, it's, it's all around music, blues is a feeling. It doesn't have to be bad. No, all around, good or bad, it's all around feeling. So it's, it's, it helps you do whatever, whatever you are, what, if, you, if you're feeling bad, it make you feel good sometimes, and sometimes it make you feel bad because someone that done hurt your feeling, you feel sad. But you play some blues, and that's what you, that's why the people call it sad. You make you feel that way. But in the long run, it just pick you up and make you start feeling good. Because I have heard had some people that uh, said, man, I had a bad day. And say, came here, said, but now I can go home and relax and go to sleep and enjoy my night now because the blues picked me up. Is there, in musically and technically seeing, is there anything you can still learn on the guitar? Yeah. There's no, you cannot master no, no instrument. I don't care what it is. Uh, this is the brains. You know, they got it. They, they can. The doctors can do everything to your body, but they can't understand the brain. And so, playing music is it, it, not. It, you cannot master it. You can always play, you're gonna play something different. Regardless, I don't, every night you play, every night, every hour, you play something different. John, what's your um, opinion of, uh, uh, towards the blues? We, we always have a lively discussion that anybody who wants to play the blues now has to know the old masters, the, 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 the Louisiana Reds, the, the, the uh, Sonny Boy Williamson's of their time before they can even start the blues and somebody say no we're gonna push the limits no matter what they are what's your opinion about that no no, no. whoever told you that they wrong you, you got to learn from the old time blues you got to start way back if you want to be a blues man uh, you just can't just pick up a guitar and start playing blues and never heard it what you playing hey there's no one alive that 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 create get, that learn a guitar playing the blues is up the person the one person that created that style and we don't know who it did I don't know who created it, but you know, hey it's no way you, you it can't do it nope 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 <laughs> you have to know the old ones you know the old one you got to know the old one it, to learn um, there's do you do you hear some new guys do you th when you think no that's a real load of rubbish they're playing well they playing their style. Yeah, they playing their style. That's a style. Everybody got a style. Um, they, they, it, I mean, they playing what they feel. Uh, it, it's they type of feeling what they got. You know, 
you got you got to have a feeling to play blues type type of music. You uh, got diversity. You can play rock, jazz, or blues, but um, blues is one music that is is so simple. It's real simple, but it's hard to some people. Well, it was hard for me too when I first began, and you know, but now it's just simple, you know, so because I learn something on it every day. I'm still learning. You never, you never, like they say, you're never too old to learn. So I'm still learning on the guitar. I learn something every day. I pick it up. I, I be. It's kind of in between. It's hanging, it's hanging right there. But, but you know, blues is one day is years is up like this, and the next day it's come down. Half it never goes to the bottom. It always stays in the middle of whatever plan. But it goes up, come down. But it's gonna always be that way because it's so much competition, competition for the blues. You know, all this, all the rock and uh, just rap, disco and stuff, which I love. All the stuff that uh, I hear. But it's a competition, but it goes up and down. But someday, maybe, we keep on pushing it. It's going to get bigger. It's going to be big one day. What's your um, primary uh, source of income? Is it live playing or still the, the, the selling of CDs with the internet and all uh, important to you? Yeah, you know, uh, make CDs and sell CDs. Make, you know, help you out with your tour, you know, uh, with your uh, expenses. That's why we do a CD, uh, sell them to help our expenses, you know, uh, and it's good to do that. You know. Are you into the, the internet thing or so yeah, that yeah. people can download your songs on yeah, iTunes or the song, uh, go online and do it, uh, cdbaby.com, yeah, they sell a lot too, but you can go online and, uh, and uh, you can order my CD from there. So just, just hit John Primer, www.johnprimerblues.com. Well, everything. And that's a beautiful end for this interview. And yeah. <laughs>